potentially shutting the door on a rotten problem. It's awesome because we don't have room for compost, obviously. This industrial dehydrator shreds, heats and treats up to 100 kilograms of food waste at a time. We can reduce the amount of food waste down by 80 to 85 per cent. It's one of six set up in apartment complexes in Melbourne to deal with a complicated issue. About 40 per cent of Australia's food waste goes to landfill. A lot comes from high rises with little green space. This new trial is actually a first of its kind in Australia. 84% of our residents in our municipality live in high rise and the, the solution uh, to our waste issues in the city of Melbourne really means that we have to focus on high rise. There are more than 368,000 high rise residential apartment towers in Australia. Almost 14% of the nation lives in a flat or apartment. In New South Wales, 22%. Queensland, 13%. And in Victoria, 12%. This growing family of four is just eight levels up on a 21-storey complex, but struggled with the kilograms of scraps coming from the kitchen until the trial started. It's so super easy, yeah, you like literally just put it in and then you close the door and it just does whatever it does. When it is done, what's left is 100% fertiliser, meaning nothing going to landfill. And that fertiliser is given back to residents to use in the green space they do have. What we're trying to create is a circular solution. Almost all kinds of green waste, including food scraps like proteins, meats, can be processed by this. It does take about eight hours, but that is a lot faster than composting does organically anyway. The council's spending $300,000 on the trial, which it says will be expanded if successful. Iskander Rozak, ABC News, Melbourne.